Hi folks, this is Steve Rossetti, co-founder of MoviePix.com and author of the MoviePix.com Guide to CyberLink Power Director. And here we are in CyberLink Power Director Ultimate. Now today I want to talk about preferences because there are some helpful preferences, or preferences worth knowing here in CyberLink Power Director. Now your preferences can be found under the edit menu, or you can just click on the cog here at the top of the menu. Right here on the general page, a couple of useful menu options. If you look under audio channels, here's where you set it from stereo to 5.1 surround sound if you're using 5.1 audio. Don't worry too much about this stuff. It's fairly automatic. If you go over to the project page, you'll find this is one thing that really annoys people and they wonder how to turn it off. How do you get rid of those sample clips that keep showing up every time you start a new project? Uncheck this and those sample clips won't be included with your regular media. Over on the editing page, you find options for setting the default duration for any photos you add. By default, they're uh, five seconds long. Transitions by default are two seconds long. I actually prefer that to be one second. The length of your titles and effects, you can set the custom, but you can of course modify that, but these are the custom default settings right here. Finally, if you're not using the Director Zone in CyberLink Cloud, or if you're not signed into them, I highly recommend you use or take advantage of these. The Director Zone is an online site, of course, where there are thousands and thousands of free templates created by fellow users for your effects, your particles, picture overlays, titles, even uh, DVD and Blu-ray menus. They're all up there for free. They're created by fellow users and you can download them. Sign up and you get full access to those. And if you want, if you create anything that is worth saving, send it on up there and share it with uh, the whole community of other PowerDirector users. The CyberLink Cloud is your personal backup. So Director Zone is for everyone to share. CyberLink Cloud is your personal backup. At the very least, sign up here uh, for your CyberLink Cloud preferences to back up to CyberLink Cloud. It doesn't back up all your projects, but it does back up your program preferences, keyboard hide keys. If anything should happen to the program or your computer, you can get those all back again and you won't have to reconfigure your program. It will save all those profiles for you. There are ways throughout the program, of course, to back up your files and your templates to the CyberLink Cloud. So I show you how to do those in other tutorials as well as in the book. And each of these preferences is worth exploring. I cover a number of them here in the book. Many of them are worth understanding and they can make your workflow go a little more smoothly. If you want to know more about them, check out the moviepix.com guide to CyberLink Power Director. It's available at amazon.com. If you've got any questions about any of these preferences at all, don't hesitate to post them to our free community forum at moviepix.com. We'll get an answer to you as quickly as possible. I'm Steve Rossetti. Thanks for joining me. Hope to see you again real soon.